Good morning, everyone. My name is Coach Heather, and I am from Playworks, Utah. Before we get started, I want to give a quick shout out to Riley Elementary School. I hope you are all doing great, and I can't wait to see you soon. All right, before we get started with our warm up this morning, we have three group agreements that we're going to go over. So I'm going to say one, and then I'm going to have you repeat it back to me. Sound good? Perfect. All right. So our first one is, I will be safe. Perfect, thank you for saying that with me. Our second group agreement is, I will be respectful. Thank you. And our third and our last group agreement this morning is, I will have fun. Thank you for saying all those with me. If you can agree to those, group agreements and you can do those with me, give me a big thumbs up. Awesome. All right. For our warm up this morning, we are going to do some stretches. We are going to do six stretches total. And our goal for each stretch is to do it for 30 seconds. Do you think you can do that? Yeah, you can try with me. Perfect. As we're going, I will explain each stretch and where you should be feeling it. Um, you ready to get started? I don't think I heard you. Are you ready to get started? Perfect. All right, stretch number one is called a forward bend. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna stand with your feet about shoulder width apart. You're gonna have your knees slightly bent, just a little bit. You're gonna raise your hands above your head and then you're gonna bend forward at the hip, just like this until your back is like a table. You see that? Okay, does that make sense? Perfect, I'm glad that makes sense. So where you should be feeling that one is in your hamstrings, that's behind your knees. Do you think you're ready to try it? Perfect, let's do it. Okay, so feet are shoulder width apart. You're gonna raise those hands up and you're gonna bend forward. Okay, so we're going to be here for 30 seconds, everyone. You can just let those arms hang loose. Let that head hang loose. You are doing great. It's already 15 seconds. You're killing this. All right. Keep those knees slightly bent. You should be feeling that right here. You feeling it? Yeah, some of us are. I'm feeling it. But guess what, y'all? That was 30 seconds. That was easy, huh? You can do that. Perfect. Now we are moving on to stretch number two. Our second stretch today is gonna be a lunge. And a lunge, you're gonna feel it in your hips, okay? But with a lunge, you can only stretch one leg at a time. So I'm gonna start with my right leg back and my left leg forward, okay? So you're gonna get down like this, you're gonna have this back leg with your foot flat on the ground, and you're gonna try and put this knee directly above this ankle, okay? And what you're gonna do is you're gonna lean forward into that, but do you see how my knee is above my toes? That's not good. That's how I'm gonna hurt myself. So I wanna push my foot forward just a little bit further so that when I'm leaning into this, my knee is still above my heel my ankles, okay? And you should be feeling that in your right hip if your right leg is the one that's back, yeah? All right, so 30 seconds, here we go. You are doing so good. Make sure you're watching this knee and this ankle. You are killing it. It's already been 15 seconds. If you feel like you don't have great balance, you can always put that hand down to help yourself stay up. That's what I have to do sometimes, and that's okay. All right, y'all. And five, four, three, two, one. And that's 30. Wonderful job, everyone. You killed it. So, you ready to do the other one? Yeah? Perfect. So what we're gonna do, I'm just gonna switch those legs. I'm gonna bring my right leg so it's up. And my left leg is back with my foot flat on that ground. And I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to push my foot a little farther forward so that when I'm leaning forward into the stretch, 
My knees are not going above my toes. All right, 30 seconds. Are you ready? Get set, go. All right, we are leaning into this. You should be feeling it in your left leg. If your left leg is down, if your right leg is down, you should be feeling it in your right leg. And you're just leaning forward. We are at 15 seconds, we're halfway there. You're watching this knee and this ankle, making sure they're still in a straight line. You're doing so good. And we are done. That's 30 seconds, y'all. You killed it. That was so good. Give yourself a high five. All right, are you ready to move on to stretch number three? All right, so this is our third stretch of six. What we're gonna do is we are going to stretch our calves, okay? So that's the back of your lower leg. Sound good? All right, you can use the wall if you need to. If you don't have a wall that you can lean against, that's totally cool. You don't need the wall. Um, what we're gonna do is you are going to bring one foot back. I'm gonna bring my left foot back first. So I'm gonna have my left leg back and out straight. I'm gonna bend my right knee just like this. And then I am going to try and um, push my left heel, since that's the heel that's back. I'm gonna try and push that into the ground as hard as I can. And with my body leaning forward like this, when I'm pushing that heel into the ground, that's gonna give me a stretch right here. You ready to try it? 30 seconds. All right, here we go. So I'm gonna lean against this wall just because it helps me get a better stretch, but you don't have to if you don't want to. You can just lean like this, it's totally cool. We are doing so good. You should be feeling that right in the back of that back leg. We are at 15 seconds already, you are killing it. Make sure you're taking deep breaths as we're going. Yeah, you wanna get all that oxygen because you don't ever want to run out of breath when you're doing stretches. You wanna make sure you're getting all the oxygen you can. And that's 30 seconds because if you're not breathing right, you're not gonna be able to get a good stretch and you're not gonna be able to play and you're not gonna be able to have fun. All right, so we're gonna go to our other leg. So whichever leg was forward and bent, that leg is now gonna go back and straight. So I'm gonna bring my right leg back and I'm gonna have my left leg forward and bent. And again, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna lean against the wall. You don't have to, but I'm gonna dig that right, that back heel into the ground. You ready? 30 seconds, here we go. We are taking big breaths. We are really digging that heel into the ground, really trying to feel that stretch in our calf. You're doing so good. We're at 15 seconds. Keep breathing, keep pushing. You are doing so awesome. Thanks for doing this with me, guys. All right, guess what? We're at 30 seconds already. Can you believe that? That was so quick. All right, give yourselves a nice high five. We have three stretches down. We're halfway done. All right, for our next stretch, we are going to be sitting, okay? So what we're gonna do is uh, you are going to put your arms out forward straight like this, and you are going to cross them over. This one's a little tricky for me personally, and you're gonna bring them up as if you're gonna hold your hands and Whichever arm is on top, you should be feeling the stretch right here in the back of your arm, okay? So I'm gonna cross my right arm over first and I'm gonna hold it like this and I should be feeling that for 30 seconds in the back of my shoulder. You ready? All right, shake those arms out, get ready. Cross them over and 30 seconds, go. We got this, you can do it. This one, I'm not very flexible with my arms, so it's a little harder for me. You might be able to do it easier. You might be in the same spot as me, and that's okay. Everyone is different. 
And guess what? We're 15 seconds down already. You guys are killing this. Like, you're so good. All right, we are almost done. Keep holding it there. And we're at 30 seconds. Shake those arms out. You ready to do the other side? Yeah, we're ready? Perfect. We gotta make sure we stretch both sides. All right, so put your arms out. You're going to cross the opposite arm over top. So I'm gonna take my left arm over top. I'm gonna to bring them up as if I'm gonna hold hands, just like this. And we're gonna do that for 30 seconds. Then we're gonna be stretching this side, okay? You ready? Arms out, cross it over, hold your hand. And here we go, 30 seconds. You can do it. I can do it. We can all do it. All right. I'm feeling that in my back. I'm feeling it real good. Are you feeling it? Yeah, you're feeling that stretch. We're 15 seconds down. We are killing it. Nice job, everyone. Just a couple more seconds. Five more seconds, y'all. Five, four, three, two, one. And let it go. We good? We're doing okay so far? Awesome. We're gonna stand back up here and we are gonna do stretch number five. You ready? So stretch number five is also our arms again. Stretch number five is gonna be stretching our triceps. So that's the back of your arm right here. What you're gonna do is you're going to take whichever arm you wanna stretch first, you're gonna bring it up and you are going to bring it back like this. And then you're gonna take this lower arm and you're gonna bring it up around your back. And you're gonna try and grab your hands. Some of us, we are really flexible right there and you're gonna be able to actually grab your hands like this. Some of us aren't even gonna be able to touch your hands. And that is okay. And you know what? Sometimes one arm can reach farther than the other. Like that's how I am. I have one arm that can stretch really good here, and one that cannot, but I'm gonna do my best. Are you ready? All right, so I'm gonna take my right arm first, and I'm gonna reach it up, and then I'm gonna take my left arm, and I'm gonna go up just like that, and I'm gonna hold this for 30 seconds. All right, here we go. We're still taking big, deep breaths. Your arms, if you can reach, try and hold your hands. If you can't reach, that's totally okay. Just do your best. We are at 15 seconds, you're killing it. Keep breathing deep. Good job. Try and stretch. Try and push yourself as, hard, as far as you can go. And that's 30. Good job, everyone. So, just like we've done earlier, if you stretch one side, you have to stretch the other. So, take the opposite arm, you're gonna bring it up, you're gonna reach back, and then the arm that was up top first, now it's gonna go up from the back, and as you can see, I can't reach like I could with the other arm. So, if you can't reach, Get in, if you happen to have a t-shirt with you, like I do, you can hold that t-shirt in the arm that's up when you reach, and then you can hold on to it with the lower arm and the upper arm, and that's gonna help you get a better stretch until you're able to actually grab those hands. Okay, so now that we are ready and we explained it, here we go. So left arm up and back, right arm up. We're gonna grab that t-shirt and we're gonna hold this for 30 seconds. Here we go. And we're gonna breathe deeply in through our nose, out through our mouth. Really, we should be feeling that in the back of your arm right there. You are doing so good, everyone. We are at 15 seconds. We're gonna go for another 15 so that we get 30 seconds total with this stretch. 
Because that's what we did on the other side. You got to make it even. All right. And done. Easy. You got it. I'm going to get rid of that t-shirt because I don't need that anymore. So we are on to our sixth and last stretch. And remember, we're trying for 30 seconds with every stretch that we're doing today. So our last stretch is going to be, <coughs> excuse me, we are going to be stretching our quads. The quads are this front part of your thighs, okay? Where are we stretching? Quads, nice job. Just making sure you're still listening. So with this one, you might want to hold on to the wall or something that's near you, or if you have really good balance, you don't need to hold on to anything, but coach doesn't have great balance. <laughs> so what you're gonna do is you are going to grab your ankle and you are going to bring it up behind you. And then you should be feeling that stretch right here. And again, we're gonna try and hold it for 30 seconds, but before we get started, make sure that you're someplace that you can either hold on to something or you're just gonna balance really good because I don't want anyone falling over and getting hurt with this stretch. Are you in a safe spot? Perfect. All right, so I'm gonna go left leg first and I'm just gonna hold it for 30 seconds. And here we go. So this stretch is so good. You use your quads and your legs for everything. Running, walking, sitting, standing. I mean, they can get so tight and then it makes it so you don't want to do anything. So this is a really good one to do just before you do any kind of sports or games or anything. And guess what? That's already 30 seconds down. That was so quick. All right, so because I have to grab the other arm, I'm gonna try and do balance this 30 seconds, okay? And one tip for balancing, if you put your hand right on your belly button, Sometimes that helps. Okay, so we're gonna try it. All right, 30 seconds. Here we go. Breathing in. Making sure we're getting all that oxygen. We should be feeling it right here. Here we go. We're doing great. You're doing great. Ooh, fell over. <laughs> That's okay. Here we go. We got 10 more seconds left. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and done. Whew. I almost fell over a couple times, but that's okay. So we did six stretches just now. We have done all six and we are so warmed up. We're so ready for the day. All right, thanks for hanging out with me, y'all. Thanks for doing those with me. Make sure you come back later when we're going to be playing a game. Uh, bye, everyone.